Hello guys and welcome to another episode of Kerbal Space Program. Uh, today I have something new. Uh, some other guy on YouTube, he made a VTOL and I thought I'd make one as well. So let's just fix this up. I did not see that. This will provide extra fuel to that. That's good. Um, as you can see, I have placed this down like so. So just you know, shift, and you click spacebar if you want to go back to the original shape or, f or angle that it was at. I've got what are these things called? Small hard points. I've got one here, two back there, because these engines were scraping on the floor, on the runway. So I had to get this elongated. <laughs> got a tail, uh, small canids, yeah, uh, nose cap, uh, yeah, some other controlling thing, avionics package. Let's test that out. Save and launch. Launch. Now when I did test this out, um, <laughs> lifting up was a bit unusual. Uh, I w this part, this back fin came off. That was funny. So let's line this up. Let's go. Alright, alright. And bang. See, the starting point is always weird. And I'm, I'm going on an angle. I'm going, falling full, well, slightly forward. Let's go full speed. It's going pretty good. No, it's not falling, but it, it looks quite good. Mm. Let's retract these wheels. G. Nice. Now. It's going pretty fast for, for a VTOL. Let's, let's try and... Well. Uh, okay. <laughs> not good. Bob is trying to show off his uh his skills, his stunts. I don't know how to fix this. Let me turn off the engines. Slow him down. You know what we need? Is to end this before we die. Alright, let's just try putting two small cannons on each side. Uh I think that must have been the problem. Hello, let's let's go launch. Let's hope we don't die. Alright. T full throttle. Let's go. Don't think we have to control it. Oh we didn't. We didn't have to control it. Alright, it was good. Stay in that position. Oh okay, it's a it's a bit heavy on the back side. Yeah, a, a lot long a lot more heavier. Yeah, like, like a lot. Huh. We're probably gonna flip unless I don't let's change anything. Let's just try and make sure we fall down a bit. G. Come on. We want to fall down. Why are we? We're going down very slowly. Turn off the engines fully. What? Alright, I'm gonna turn them back on because we're falling forward now. This is really unusual. Let's try and turn. Turning is very unusual for this one. It's quite cool. Yeah, it's nice. Nice turning. Just trying to get it done right. Ah, good. Let's hope this thing doesn't go out of whack. Let's turn, let's turn speed engines up. Alright, let's turn them down. Let's turn them off, actually. Straighten this thing up. On. 
back on again. Turn a bit. Off again. Get up. We're falling down. This makes his wheels go out again. Let's turn this thing down again. We're not going to go on the runway, that's, that's for sure. Whoa. Let's turn on this a bit. Okay. Hey, pretty good landing. Uh, I'm going to take that back pretty soon. Trying to fly. <laughs> what the? What? I don't have any engines and this thing is increasing. I'm holding down S key right now. Awesome. You don't need any engines for this thing. Ah, <laughs> uh, this is a cool glitch. I think. Pretty sure it is a glitch. Why are we slowing down right now? I'm confused. Why did we, we're speeding up again? What? How is that possible? I was gonna hold down the SK. Man, Bob, you must have some tricks. I'm still holding down SK. I'm still holding it. Man, I'm confused. This thing is a very unique VTOL. <laughs> Let's try and turn. Oh, come on, then crash. VTOL. Ah, uh, that was my fault. <laughs> uh -huh. No, I should have had the SAS on. And why are these things flying? What was that? It exploded and projectiles just went all the way down there. Wow. Let's check out this lake. <laughs> Completely fake. We can't go in. But interesting. Very nice. Well, we failed in that one. Let's check out. Let's look at that again. Hmm. Any other VTOLs? Nope. Well, I don't know what we could have done to prevent <laughs> this thing from still going. I mean, that's weird. If. I don't know how that still worked. That is very weird. I mean, if you're willing to go 45 kilometers meters per second around Kerbin, it'd take you a while, but you'd probably do it successfully. You'd just have to watch out for the big mountains. And turning would be an issue, as what I tried doing back there. Alright, guys. Uh, that's it for the episode, and...